Hi there YouTube, today I'm gonna show you how to edit, do video editing under the free Windows 11 Ubuntu Linux powered system that I have here. Welcome in my MacBook. This is my MacBook 1.1. Um, the white 13 inch from 2006 running with one gigabyte of memory. That's all there is. So um, what am I running? Officially this is Ubuntu. 14.4.3 uh, LTS long term support and uh, I changed the system a bit as you could see in my previous videos uh, into a Windows 11 system and I explained it before there's no such thing as Windows 11 it does not exist Windows Microsoft decided uh, to uh, go up to Windows 10 and that would be it there would be no Windows 11 so you know um, I made Windows 11 kinda my own so Windows 11 will only exist in my computers and in people who want to also go do that create their own Windows 11 if for some reason you know they want to be on a system that looks uh, kinda yeah whatever whatever you want to do you know for what kind of reason I'm not gonna think of a reason here for you what I'm gonna show you is how to do video editing as you know video editing costs money if you're on Windows or in Mac it costs money if you want an app like program as Camtasia it costs money you know movie edit pro uh, or movie edit pro yeah what is it Camtasia if you buy it you know it costs money and the f and the spyware you get for free that's that comes with it you know in uh, Linux there will be no such thing yeah uh, as you could see I updated the icon I hope you like it you know I went from the Windows 8 kind of icon to yeah around uh, yeah updated icon so this is uh, soon we're gonna do something about the icons but uh, let's jump into the video editor so let's fire her up the video editor is called OpenShot and today in fact um, I'm gonna create my first video with OpenShot. Uh, here you can see that OpenShot is open now and we're gonna import some videos. Okay. Um, now I must see which video I need to import because I just copied some some videos. Let me see what this is. Does not support this file. What is this? No, this is not. You know, that is kind of hard sometimes. I created. Let's go to my iPhone. I created two files. To in, uh, intro and an outro video, but I can't seem to find them. So I'm gonna put it on list view and then uh, date modified. So that should be these two here. Oh, no. This is also very, very stupid. Mavericks came with something idiotic. that is kind of there I don't know what is doing there so we're gonna put that to the desktop is the 2039 and uh, I'm talking about this thing here it's very annoying this thing I don't I don't know why they made it it's very annoying you keep clicking click keep clicking miss you know so Ubuntu I don't know what that is. I don't know why you guys did it. Maybe you want to look like, uh, like Mavericks or like Windows. Don't do it. This is Windows 11. So hear me talking. 
Rabis. So um, this is the video effect. So now I'm gonna import the video, import video files. And somewhere here, I think, where was it? In my videos, I think. No, in my documents. Uh, in Mac. Let me see which one it was. I think it was this one. Date modified. This is this video what we're making right now. You can see it growing. I think it was this one. I'm never sure where the size is, you know. Uh, well, this one we can put straight up in the video editor. You see, we're gonna mix a MKV and a MOV file. So we can close this. So let me see if this empty fail is right. Hello there, my lovely YouTube friends, girlfriends. Okay, that is it. So what I'm gonna do, in fact, now, I'm gonna put in this video here. <coughs> Sorry for that. And then I'm gonna put in this video okay I can even give it a beautiful transition let's give it a fractal whatever that is called you just put it there and it will put it in place itself so you don't have to worry about that and then up here we're gonna make this a little bit smaller 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 so and then uh, we go back to the project files and then of course we're gonna add the end clip this one here okay and that should sound like this play you see specially designed so that is it uh, in fact uh, my people that is how to uh, in fact um, you will not see this video that uh, that you see here in the working field you will see this video that I'm creating right now this video that you're listening to that will be the video that you will see uh, in here because I was already showing it but I was not happy about the result I wanted to make something nice so that video will also be kind of shorter than this one this one was way too long 22 minutes so peeps I wish you there a very beautiful beautiful weekend uh, and for the rest uh, of you guys listening in the mid of the week uh, a great week make something nice of it and uh, yeah try it out you can get this by just downloading Ubuntu 15 and if you want to have it like my like my kind of styled uh, look and feels then I would go for mate I would go for mate because mate will help you to do these things that you see here okay um, now that we have this whole video done of course you can save it but you can also export it okay and let me show you some export settings real fast before we're gonna close this video you can go to advanced and se select the complete profile here what you want to do this is just a desktop recording so in fact it's no big deal you know it, it will be recorded just fine if you select a profile from here it's not for a DVD, it's not for a device, it's not for Blu-ray, it's for web. 
so what kind of uh, website will you post it to well I want a YouTube HD file so how about the quality well I really want the highest possible quality you see that and then you hit export I will not do it now because I'm not gonna use that video that you see in here in fact this one I will delete I will remove it remove the clip so and now I'm gonna add the clip that we just uh, that we created uh, at this moment of talking so peeps I wish you there all the best and till my next video by the way don't uh, hesitate to ask any questions if you like it of course leave your like behind it's very important you know subscribe to my channel and uh, always uh, if you have some advice etc you know always leave your little advice behind because other people also read it and they also learn from that and that is what the purpose is of what i'm doing spreading the love and spreading yeah the knowledge what we know and what we can you know teach somebody else if it comes up to computers and so many other things so check out my videos and see you soon